Okay. So, we're playing with another remote control, uh, a CAD software. This is across the internet. And um, it's working really well. It's really simple, too. Um, it's uh, very interesting. Uh, some people are using this, I think, to control uh, HRD. Uh, Ferry uh, showed me this. I installed it with a little bit of trouble. I installed it, but I'm not running HRD now. I'm just, it's got its own uh, little client that runs or a little server that runs. And um, the interesting thing is, uh, the software is free, or you can buy the pro version for $3.95. What do you think about that? So you can change your power. Let's see. Change your power levels. You can change your sidebands. You can turn the antenna tuner on or off. Um, noise blankers, noise reduction. It's kind of cool. It's kind of cool. You can uh, also... Um, you click band it brings the band up and uh, you can dial the frequency or you can hold this frequency and it'll let you uh, enter in the keyboard like uh, 7 dot 200 set and there's the PTT button right there you just press it when you want to talk it's pretty cool. I've got it turning the radio on and off. I'm using my same box I built uh, with for HRD that turns the radio and power supply on and off. So uh, watch what happens when I hit the power switch here. I'm going to hit the power switch right here. And it's going to turn the power off. Or it should. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. Well, the reason, okay, it turned the power supply off. The reason it didn't turn the radio off, I have the radio plugged into a different a different power supply now, so that's why it didn't turn the radio off. But uh, the little on-off here will actually turn my power supply on and off with my, with my box I built. So if we press the button here, it should turn the power supply on. There we go. All right. 